Hello everyone, Sean here once again, and we're back with another Poly Bridge. As always, please remember to like and subscribe, it really does help me a lot, but for now, let's get into today's puzzle. And, we're working on budget cuts. So, world, uh, world one, number nine. Uh, so we're looking at reducing cost here. So, what are we thinking? What do we think would do the best? I'm actually thinking, can we go down here? It just doesn't quite reach there. Can we go down here? This should have a lot of horsepower, I'm guessing, right? 30. Yep. Much more than the uh, Vespa that we had earlier. Um, so I think it should be able to make this turn. Um, we can see maybe it won't, but I'm actually going to just be tempted to support this with some trusses across the top and see what happens. I'm going to actually come back and retriangulate that one that just missed a little bit, but I think that's going to be good for now. Let's try this out. It does have to support quite a bit of weight. And it, of course, does not. Um, I think this is actually going to be an issue there. I kind of want that more like that. And I think we should try and create a big arch here. And I think kind of getting these Getting the second ones a little more vertical there, really pulling on that arch as it is. Um, probably do the same over here. Ooh, we're already over budget. All right. Hopefully we're on the right track and we can just clean it up a little bit. I'd... There we go. Now we're back on our budget. Let's test this out. It's getting real close. Let's get real close. Made the turn. That's good. That bridge is sagging so much. 98%. Oh, we were so close there. All right. So I want to get this arch a little bit bigger, which means we have to sacrifice somewhere. I think we can actually sacrifice right here. I think that's going to be the key. Okay. So we're just under budget by $12. Just enough to get lunch. Not cheap lunch. Let's be, let's be honest. Inflation is real. 99? Oh, we were so close here. Bulldozer went underwater. All right. Let's uh, let's cheapen this left side and reinforce the right side. There we go. I want to make this arch a little bigger here. All right. A dollar. Just enough for uh, a piece of candy. Uh, that's tough. That's real tough. 94% is what I saw so far. 90, 99. Oh, so, so close. All right. I'm not sure what we can do at this point to, sh to shore this up. I think it's mostly on shape. I think it's less about... Uh, how much material is where, and more just about the actual shape of the arches. I can pull this down a little bit and get this more archy. I think that'll help. Okay, we are perfectly on budget here. Not a not a dime to spare. Ninety one. That transition's a little rough, but he's making it. He's making it. Oh, once again, so close. All right. Do we have to reevaluate something? What are we? What can we lose? Can we lose this piece? Can we lose that piece to increase the angle of this arch, make that a little more supportive? Move these just a little bit farther out over the node that they have to support. I'm actually wondering, too, if we want to just give this a little bit of a... No. Yeah, I'm going to give this a little bit here, just so that that one piece is a little bit longer. That might be a mistake. Let's find out. Well, I think we all learned a valuable lesson there. We need that piece. All right, let's try again. Okay, yeah, that piece was critical. No. 
Did lengthening the oh lengthening that piece of road and increasing that arch helped. We had we saved thirty dollars on our budget. Never mind the four bulldozers that we dumped in the water. Uh, we are thirty dollars under budget and therefore deserve a raise. Very fun. Thank you, Slender. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like and subscribe. It really does help me a lot. And share this video with anyone you think would enjoy these games. That's all for now, and we will see you all in the next one.